Hello everyone and welcome to Bahrain. It is back, Vortex Racing League's highlights on my channel. Uh, first of all, apologies that I've been away for so long. Um, I've had loads of uni, or had loads of uni work uh, leading up to Christmas, which I needed to focus on because uh, I'm in my final year at uni. I'll probably talk about that at some point um, on a different video on the channel. So I had a real tough ends the term uh, to get all that work done and then I had a bit of time off um, at my parents house uh, in Sheffield and, and I don't think they would have appreciated me yelling down a microphone um, to F1 races so uh, so I wasn't really able to do any videos I wasn't feeling much like it because I was quite tired after all that uni work so apologies for the absence for the like last month and a half and if you can't take the apology do you know, do you know what D deal with it absolutely deal with it and yes that is my face on my uh, youtube channel for the first time there's a story behind that picture which once again i'll i'll say another time anyway i'm rambling let's get into uh, what we've got on the screen here uh, this is my fastest lap in qualifying around bahrain uh, round four yes round four of um the f1 PS3 Championship part of the Vortex Racing Leagues. Um, as I said, during during the time of this race actually going on, I had all the uni work, so I was not quick at all, although that, that really doesn't help. Codemasters, what's going on with the most impenetrable bollard the world has ever seen? What, what's, what's going on there? Anyway, qualifying results read this off my tiny little screen Italian Blue takes pole Tyler second, Little Paul third good qualifying from Gadelho up in fourth uh, I take fifth uh, Liam my teammate sixth uh, Demi seventh SS Power eighth and Richie ninth, bottom three not completing laps so onto the race itself good chance of some good points today well of course it's good chance of points because there's only nine racing um, but as we take the lights we've got Gadelho to our right Little Paul straight ahead of us it's five lights they're out we're away off the grid it's not the best of starts bit tardy light uh, Liam's on my inside you can see with the three hours there Gadelho moves across Oh, and that's getting a bit tight. Gadelho gets into Tyler, and all chaos has broken loose here. I'm somehow stuck between Gadelho and Liam, and nowhere to go. And I'm just going to slam on the brakes to get us, get us out of that little sandwich. Coming back in from from the right, and all in all, that is a messy start. Tyler's lagging all over the place. I break way too late. That's an absolute dumb move there by me. Um, I'm just going to let everybody get past because that was totally my fault. Taking out Liam, taking out Gadelho, I think, as well. Fully deserved to put himself at the back of the grid for that one. Bit race tardy there. And oh dear, what's going on there? A little bit of contact with uh, Gadelho as I'm trying to let him pass. A little bit unnecessary, but we'll, uh, we'll carry on. So, uh, lap seven not much really going on we overtake little Paul who had taken some time in the pits starts a lap 9 though and little Paul was absolutely over, all over my rear end my tyres were pretty shot at this point as we're defending through I think is it turn 3, turn 4 I never know which one it is on, on this track but uh, we're still defending from little Paul as we go through the quick the quick uh, S turns which only really have one line through you can't really overtake through there defending deep or oh, little Paul might have a chance here to go round the outside we're side by side it's a left hand and next so I've got the line the inside line but I've gone far too deep in what really is one of the trickiest corners on the game I think that corner that double apex constantly tightening the car naturally wants to understeer there so it's not a surprise that I ran off at that corner Lap 11, pit stop time, taking the hard tyres, I think that's a hard tyre, I'm putting the medium tyre on, um, and away we go. So lap 12, and Little Paul loses connection, not for the first time this season. What a shame for Little Paul there, that's, that's not great for him at all. 
but it's good for me because it means I gain a position. Lap 20, middle stint of this race, nothing really happened um, apart from little Paul disconnecting from the race. So we pit for a new set of the medium Pirelli tyres and we're off and away again, but this really isn't looking like a, a good result at all. The speed that I've got at the moment isn't great and as such on lap 22 I get lapped. Frustratingly though, a lap later the safety car comes out, so if I'd been able to hold on for that one lap, I actually would have gained stacks of time, but it wasn't meant to be. Cause of the safety car was Tyler crashing out and on lap 25, in fact I think it was the impenetrable bollard that took him out, I may be wrong, I'm, I'm commentating on this quite a few weeks after the race itself, but anyway lap 26, I've got blue flags galore as I've got pretty much the whole field behind me, I go far too deep, but Italian blue takes uh, past me, although Italian blue goes spinning off there, that's a really bad incident for Italian Blue, Liam's come past me in the meantime um, and then I'm in a bit of uh, Felipe Massa mode here trying to hold everybody up uh, as much as possible yet legally, I think that says his power going through and who's this, oh dear that's not great driving there from whoever that was running me up the backside. I wasn't going particularly slowly both Lotuses have taken me Italian Blue's somewhere behind us as well and that was pretty much it for my race, uh, not the most exciting race to come back to guys, I, I apologise for that, um, but yeah, Liam takes the win, uh, SS Power second, Richie takes a good podium in third, Demi in fourth with a penalty, Gadelho fifth, uh, sorry no that's Italian Blue in sixth, um, me in seventh, Tyler eighth and Little Paul in ninth. So thank you for watching the video guys, I hope you've enjoyed it. On the screen are two videos that you may have missed. On the uh, left is uh, my most recent episode of 3 Laps 3 Topics and on the right is another highlights reel from the Vortex Racing League. I've been Andrew the Blade, thank you for watching, I'll see you later.